Welcome to our journey, Every Cowgirl Needs a Horse, brought to you by Rye Elementary Title I Team. Every Cowgirl Needs a Horse by Rebecca Janey and illustrated by Lynn Averill. I'm a cowgirl from head to toe, and every cowgirl needs a horse, so I asked for one for my birthday. Birthday morning, I shook the sleep out of my braids, and I dressed for riding. I pulled up my jeans, snapped on my chaps, tugged on my boots, tipped my hat. Morning, Nellie Sue, I said to the mirror. Morning, Mama answered. What would be the birthday girl like for breakfast? Something that'll stick to my ribs. I got chores to do. After breakfast, I hosed fresh water into Ginger's trough and moseyed off to muck the stalls in the barn. Outside, I scattered seeds for the free-range chickadees. Mama called out, need a little help? No, I said, what I really need is a horse. I wrangled our wagon out of the shed and piled it high with grass harvested from our own backyard. Only the best from my new filly. Daddy asked, you need help? No, but I do need a horse, I told him. Lunchtime came, but my horse had not. Still, I'd worked up an appetite doing chores, and Mama made me my favorite chili and beans. After lunch, Daddy hollered, time to round them up for cake and ice cream. I looped Ginger's leash into a lasso. Yee-haw! I've got herding to do. We circled the block, barking and yelling until we scared up a stampede of kids. One little one broke away, and I almost had to hogtie him. I threw up my arms and shouted, I'd do better with a horse. Soon as the herd gathered, Mama passed out Johnny Cakes. I strummed my guitar while we all sang Happy Birthday and Home on the Range. I enjoyed a good time around the campfire. And then it happened. Daddy said, Hey, Nellie Sue, got a horse here for you. He patted the saddle of a brand new bike. Isn't she a beauty? She has shiny silver coat with a bright pink saddle and a pale pink mane. Well, you gonna ride her? Daddy asked. All eyes were on me. I felt like I swallowed a hay bale. I wasn't real keen on riding a horse with wheels where hooves ought to be. She's ready for riding, Daddy coaxed. I walked over to her with my palm out flat so she could get a good sniff. Well, beauty, I whispered, you gonna let me lead you around a little? With everyone staring, I judged I better give him a show. Like a true cowgirl, I put one boot in the stirrup flung my other leg over the saddle, and pedaled like I was running from a wild hog. We skedaddled down that hill. Giddy up! Straight over the chicken wire fence and into the garden, right in the middle of Mama's tomatoes. Thud! Smack! Wham! Beauty was hurt real bad. I hugged her close and hollered for my dad. Look, Daddy, I cried. That chicken wire poking right through her hoof. Sure enough, Beauty had a puncture wound. Will she be okay, I asked. Daddy wrapped up Beauty's wound, pumped her full of medicine, and said, Well, now she's good as new. That a girl, I whispered, holding her steady. Beauty seemed taller and wiser, too. But maybe that was me getting a little horse sense of my own. Beauty, I told her. A real cowgirl always gets back in the saddle. Let's do it. I stuck my boots in the stirrups and gripped the reins. Beauty held her head high and cantered along, gaining speed. My braids blew like kite tails as we galloped down the slope and grinned until I could taste the wind. 
Yes, sir, I'm a cowgirl from head to toe, and all a cowgirl really needs is a horse. And I do have that. Wrangled. Vocabulary from every cowgirl needs a horse. When W and R are together, W is too shy. So the only letter that says its name is R, and it says R. Wrangled is past tense. When you add ed at the end of a word, it makes it past tense. There's three sounds if it's past tense and you're adding ed. It can say ed, it can say d, and it can say t. Well, wrangle, if you hear at the end of that word wrangle, it is voiced. You can feel it in your throat. You touch your throat. It says wrangle d. If it's unvoiced, it says t. And if a word ends with a t or a d, it says ed. So that is a word wrangled. It already happened. Wrangle. Wrangle has two syllables. Wrangle. The first definition of the word wrangle, there are two. One is wrangle means to round up, herd, or take charge of livestock. The second one, wrangle, can also mean to have a fight or argue with somebody. I wrangled our wagon out of the shed and piled it high with grass harvested from our own backyard. John wrangled with his sister about who was going to feed the animals.